Sarasota police have arrested twin brothers in connection with a series of pellet gun shootings taking place over the last few months. They now believe there could be more victims. Stay on your side, Sarasota County Bureau reporter Allison Henning joins us now live just outside of police headquarters with more. Allison. Hey guys, good afternoon. So police say they are targeting cars driving by their home. Thankfully, nobody has been injured at this point. I did speak with one of the victims off camera who told me he now does everything he can to avoid driving down that street. These are mug shots of Jason and Jeremy Versacos. It's tough to tell them apart because they're twins. The 39 year old brothers are at the center of an ongoing investigation in their Sarasota neighborhood. Over the last few months, police say they've received a number of reports of cars getting hit by pellet guns on Brink Avenue between 17th Street and 12th Street. This is a photo one of the victims shared with eight on your side Thursday, showing his back passenger window shattered. This kind of crime where people are being targeted and, and shot at, the Sarasota Police Department is just not going to allow to continue to happen. Police say it was surveillance footage from the Versaco's own home on Brink Avenue that tied Jason to one of the incidents last month. He remains in the county jail, charged with shooting into an occupied vehicle. His brother Jeremy is facing charges of resisting an officer without violence. We want to know why these brothers are doing this, why they have targeted just random people that are driving down Brink. The twins' neighbors were hesitant to speak with us on camera, only telling eight on your side the issues are nothing new. And again, police want to hear from the public. They think there could be at least 10 victims who have not come forward yet. Josh. Now, Allison, do these brothers have a criminal history at all? Josh, they both actually have quite an extensive criminal history here out of Sarasota County dating back to 2001. Some of those charges include fraud, theft, as well as aggravated battery. Mm, interesting. All right, Allison Henning live for us in Sarasota. Thanks for that.